game coverage. Brought to you by Ansira.com. Good evening, everybody, and welcome live to Bandera High School, where later on tonight, Crystal City and Atlanta will play some football, a neutral side stadium for this 4A by district matchup. Now, led by head coach David Lopez, the Crystal City Havelinas are having one of their best seasons in team history. They finished the regular season 8-2 and two overall and 3-1 and one in District 14 4A2, second behind Divine. Now, their 8-2 and two mark is currently second best in school history, just behind the 1953 team that went 9-1-1. One one. The Havelinas are enjoying their ninth winning season and are making just their fifth playoff appearance, but second in a row. Coach Lopez graduated from Crystal City in 1990 and has turned this program around. Now, yesterday we spoke with Coach and four of his student athletes who all hope to make some playoff history tonight against the three and seven Yellow Jackets. Well, everything that we've earned, we worked for. Like nothing that we got is given. Like we had to work for everything we got. We worked for our respect. Everything. Tell me about your head coach, man. He's really helped turn this program around. Uh, he's a big inspiration. He he made me fall in love with the game. He's taught me a lot. Uh, without him, he, we wouldn't have been here. He, he guided us the right path, and we're just doing what he says. Tell me about head coach, man. He's really helped turn this program around. Uh, he turned it around big time. I mean, uh, about two years ago, we were nothing. This program was nothing. And without him, we wouldn't be nothing right now. He's a great coach. Honestly, he loves us all. Make sure everybody's dip disciplined and just what is it? We wouldn't train for the world. So, Lano, what do you know about them and what's it going to take to beat those guys? Honestly, I feel like they're like us. They can run the ball. They have, they have a good D, good O, and they're in the reason. They're the playoffs for a reason. He's an amazing coach, actually. He pushes me to do so many great things. He's like another father to me, actually. Oh yeah. Yeah. So what kind of things does he push you to do? Uh, overall, just become a better person and athlete. Um, two years ago, I didn't think I'd be where I'm at now. But with his guidance and help, I become actually a pretty good athlete. <laughs> Lano, what do you know about them, and what's it going to take to beat them? Uh, it's a passing school from what I know, and um, they're from a pretty good district. But as long as we play together and do what we need to do and get everything we need done, play together, we should be fine. The hard-nosed West Texas team, uh, I, I think... Uh, I think it's going to be a heck of a matchup. We're physical. They're physical. Uh, we run 70% of the time. So do they. So basically, this game will be won on, on that front line. All right, just two games on the road trip tonight. This one right here in Bandera. And we'll end the night with Sam Houston at Bernie Champion.